Hello everyone, it's Allie from Titan and welcome back to our channel. I am here today with a bonus opening. Not more product, but I did get in some more packages, so I'm excited to open them up because I really appreciate everything that you all send me. It's still crazy to find myself receiving like mail from you guys, but I definitely want to show off all my reactions to everything that I get. I know there was that one package that my boss opened on accident from Zach M that did have a really awesome Ben Bishop patch auto in it now that is in the community tab that was a couple weeks ago, well i think more than a couple weeks ago now and there has been some mail opening since but i do try to open everything that i can on camera for you all and we do have three packages today this one right here is from jay phrase the original sender he is from ontario so we have now two back-to-back -back mail openings with people from ontario so oh oh this is a good segue to announce uh i mean it's not really an announcement but uh I have new background, <laughs> but uh, Thunderbug now has a friend. I, d I did pick up this baby Yoda. I thought he was too adorable, and I was like, I don't know what to do with him, and I'm like, you know what? I could put him on a shelf somewhere, and Thunderbug can have a friend, so I was like, all right, decision made. I'm adding him to my cart, so I did pick up this baby Yoda at Target yesterday. He is just chilling right over here. I'm not certain where I'm going to put him permanently, but I still have Thunderbug over here on the shelf from this past weekend's live stream, which we do have live streams every Saturday night starting at 7.45 p.m. Eastern. We do live box breaks and interact with all of you in chat. So if you could stop by or perhaps you want a personal break for yourself, the link to our website is in the top of the description down below. And just, yeah, just come hang out with us. It is a wonderful time. I love interacting with all of you. But anyways, maybe you ought to help me with that segue. But now we are back to mail. As I was saying, well, now we have two mail openings back to back with Ontario packages. So, you know, I don't know that Quebec Ontario rivalry is looking like Team Ontario right now. But <laughs> I'm just kidding. But this is from Jay Fraze, the original sender. Thank you so much. Then we have one from Robert R. from Connecticut in this package right here. And then this one is particularly heavy. And I made a joke when my boss handed it to me because I, I have big hands. I've mentioned it before. Like, let me get. Um, Random look I have random prison basketball cards, but like the size of my hand compared to the cards like I know I say I have big hands But like look look, but I picked it up and I was like haha Haha, -ha, this is jumbo stellar sketch size, so I'm probably just out of my mind But I, I am a bit suspicious of this package because it is heavy it does have something rectangular in it So I don't know. I hope I didn't like big brain myself out of like an amazing surprise, but I don't know I'm suspicious, like, what would be this big? I don't know. So I'm going to save that one to last, just in case it is something, like, mind-blowing. I mean, everything I appreciate. I think y'all catch my joke. But speaking of Stellar, have you all seen the announcement for Stellar 4 this year? It looks great. I'm super excited. They brought back these 5x7 sketches again this year with Luis Draper and Carlos Caballero. So I'm super duper 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 excited for that. And I've made my boss order four cases, so look forward to an opening of at least one case on the channel when that does come out in October. Early birthday for me. But anyway, anyways, 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 we're here for mail openings. Come on. I'm here for mail. Not sure if anyone even is watching this video. But I'm excited. Let's get into package number one from Jay Phrase, the original, by snapping myself into the corner. And let's get right into it. Alright, knife. Alright. Nailed it. Sometimes I have issues with very simple things. Ooh, we have another note. Let me hear. Here we go. Hey Ali, Jay Frace here again. Hoo ha, chippy cha in the streaming community. Hope you're doing well and staying safe. Congrats on 2000. I knew it wouldn't take long. When I build a PC, it can't be complete without these components. <laughs> RC Auto Mem Relic. I did some hunting and here is a hand. Hope you enjoy again. Stay safe. Thank you for your content. Keep it up. Stay safe and thank you. See you in your next video. Thanks again. Stay safe. Bye. Well, you're the best, Ali. Jay Frace. Thank you so much, Jay Frace. That's awesome. Now I do keep, I have to put up a picture at some point, that would be good for my Instagram actually, but I do tape all the notes that I have received from your guys' packages on the wall. Now I have six. That's cool. Let me put Jay Phrase next to his original note. Have that kind of at an angle that I can flip that up and look at the back, but thank you so much. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I see Ben Bishop cards. I see baby Ben cards. Ooh, I am so excited. We have a victory rookie of Ben Bishop when he played for St. Louis. As a goaltender. Ooh. Nice painting is taped too, so it comes off very clean. Ooh. 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 But here, let's start with this one. We have Victory Rookie, Ben Bishop, goaltender for the St. Louis Blues. That is from 2008 09 Hockey Series 2. Very cool insert there. Thank you so much. Oh, he's so young. 
I say that like I'm not younger than him, but you know what I mean. Then we have a, a leaf vault in the game. Between the pipes, Goldie Graf. Ben Bishop for the Lightning. Ooh. With his jersey number. I love them jersey number descriptions. This is from 2014. You've received a Goldie Graf card from the 1314 in the game. Between the pipes series. In front of this card is an authentic Ben Bishop autograph. Ooh. Yay. And we do have a jersey. A game jersey from... One of the Upper Deck Series. This is 2015-16 Upper Deck Series 1 Hockey. With the Lightning piece. I have some from recent years. Maybe even this year's Series... No, it had to be last year's Series 1 or Series 2. Of him. I have a white one and a green one from his Dallas jersey. But I don't have any Lightning Ben Bishop pieces from a Base Series Upper Deck. That is so cool. Thank you so much, Jay Phrase. I love all these. These are amazing additions to my Ben Bishop collection. Oh man, you all are so great. Thank you so much. This is great. Thank you. Oh man, these are some awesome packages today. But yeah, let me move this one out of the way. Spacer. And my Spacer collection from all the SB Authentic and the ice opening this morning also had spaces in it. But these are from Jay Frace. Thank you so much. This is awesome. Memorabilia, autograph, and rookie card for my collection. I love it and really appreciate it. Thank you so much. But next up, we have package from Robert R. from Connecticut. And this package right here is four ounces. So probably just cards in here. Very securely packed as well. Let me... I'm going to take the knife. Cut along... The pull tab approximately. Looks like I have to cut this little bit of tape up here as well. Yes. Alright. Nailed it. Is there a note in Ooh, there is a note in here as well. Nice. Ooh, that's cool. We have a card over Hate Rookie right there. We have a note. Ooh. Dear Allie, I love your channel. Keep up the great work. Best channel ever. Thank you for keeping me entertained during these hard times. I hope you enjoy your gift. From Sam R, aka Sam Sports Shop. <laughs> Subscribe to my channel, says Sam. Sam's hung out with us a few times in our live stream. And he is very kind. So, at least from what I have seen. But uh, yeah, Sam Sports Shop, everybody. <laughs> but yeah, thank you so much, Sam. Let's check all this stuff out. Ooh, we have some race cards as well. Looks like we have a whole mixed bag, literally, right here. here but first off let's take a look at this card over Hagee rookie this is cool don't have one like this this is from NHL rookie box set 2019-20 oh that's cool not familiar with that set I have to look into that find out what that is let's take a look here looks like some raised cards these are cool oh that's cool all-star game Austin Meadows and we also have a Nate Lau rookie card and a Jesus Aguilar from the Rays this one I think is this year, Series 1, yep. This is Series 1 2020, and then these are from last year, if I'm remembering the designs correctly. These are from Update. Okay, so these are from 2019 Update. Cool, cool, raise cards, nice. I don't have any raise cards in my collection, actually. Ooh, looks, we got some more lightning here. We have MVP, Tyler Johnson. This is 2017-18 MVP. We have an OPG Joan here, who is no longer with the lightning, actually. He plays for the Canes. It was weird seeing him when I was at the, uh, I was at actually a Canadians versus Lightning game at the Bell Center this past, should be in October, I don't think it was in, yeah, the one, the game I went to in September was the Canadians versus the Panthers, but uh, it was weird having Joanne still there, but like wrong team, if that makes sense. And these are cool, this is from 1819 Series 2 and 1819 Opeechee. Strawman plays for the Panthers now, that was so weird, it's like Strawman's on the Panthers, it's like. It doesn't make sense. But this is so cool. Thank you so much, Sam. Really appreciate these additions to my collection. And a start of a race collection. Now, I, now that I think about it, I actually literally don't own any race cards. I have a couple of race shirts and hats, but I didn't have any cards, so that's awesome. Thank you so much, Sam. With the note. I'll have to... Yeah, I can do it now. I have tape right here. But yep, thank you so much, Sam, here for sending me these cards, and I will add their note right here to the wall. Alright, cool. So thank you so much, Sam, so far, and Jay Phrase, Hoo-Ha, Chippy Cha, and Sam Sport Shop. 
Let me move this out of the way. Now we have room for this big package. Like I said, it was looking at me funny. Hopefully I didn't... Hopefully it's not what I think it is and then I've, like, ruined the surprise for myself. But I am very curious to see what this is. Because, like I said, it is heavy. It is kind of, like, thick. Like something is wrapped up in cardboard, perhaps. But I am so curious to see what's in here. From Kyle S. from Washington. And it is a flat rate envelope. Yeah, like I said, it is heavy, it is thick. I'm excited to see what's in here. Just title this video, Ali Struggles to Open Packages. <laughs> this is cool. Oh, there is a box. Alright, let's check this out. This is quite heavier when it's you're holding it without the package. All right. So this is a priority mail small flat rate box. It says enjoy the mail day. Thank you, Kyle. I will. I am. I'm enjoying everything so far. There's something in here. No. All right. It is nothing crazy because I would have been actually a little bit upset that if it was something like that. It's like how could you send me something like that? I'm. Ooh. Ooh. What is that? I knew there was something heavy. Ooh. What is this? Ooh, that is so cool! World Cup Hockey 2016 JSA Authenticated. The Witness Protection Program. James Spence Authentication. This is cool. So this is an authentic puck. Alright. Oh, it's- oh my goodness! That's on the back! I didn't even see it! I was like, alright, authenticated puck. That is cool! That is a signed Ben Bishop puck from the World Cup in 2016. Uh that is so cool. That is amazing. Thank you so much. Oh, there's more Ben Bishop cards over here. Let me see what's in. Oh, there's Star Wars. Ooh. All right. Let's see what's up. This is awesome. Hey, it's the opposite color of the one from J Phrase. UD game jersey in the blue. Oh, they're so cool. This one is 1516. Oh, it's 1516, right? Yes. So cool. Now I have matching pieces. I had the two colors from Dallas. Now I have the two colors from the Lightning. That is amazing. Thank you, Kyle and Jay Phrase, for these. Spacer. Yes, for the spacer. Ooh, oh, oh, ooh. We have a monochromatic jersey piece here from Ben Bishop. That is cool. That's also, oh, it's from SBX. Oh, okay. Older. Sometimes I don't recognize older sets, but yeah, it makes sense now that I see what the- there's the SB up there. Nice. We have Ben Bishop. Is that a real autograph as well? <gasps> there's so many Ben Bishop autographs! It is! This is cool. Received a trading card autograph. This is from 2014-15 Masterpieces. Oh, that's so cool. Oh man, I'm gonna go broke getting magnetics for everything. We have ringside signings. It's a little acetate autograph. Oh man. That's from Ice. Relevant. We just opened some ice this morning. That looks so cool. Oh, it is, and they even looked a little. We have the little. I don't know if it's easy for you guys to see or not. But the uh, the lightning, the lightning logo right there in the center. Oh, this is all amazing. And that is so cool. Oh man, Star Wars. So we got some Star Wars over here as well. With the, I didn't know. I thought this was actually in the pack, but it is on the pack. It is the uh, Rogue One, one of the Rogue One series stickers of Baze Malbas. Those were on cards. If it is the sticker, I'm I'm thinking is they had like stickers. Sometimes Star Wars sets have sticker inserts, so that's cool. I've never actually seen one used before. Well, let's see what we have here. There's some kind of was it masterwork something? Ooh, that. Ooh, wow. Never have one of these before. Shield bunker inner panel of C3PO. Number 47 out of 255. Oh, wow. Authentic wall panel from the Imperial Shield Bunker on Endor. That's cool. And we have... Let me not get myself spoilers. We have an authentic costume relic from the Stormtrooper from The Force Awakens. That's cool. Canister. Okay. Screen-worn piece of material from The Force Awakens. Oh, wow. Newer Star Wars, but how do I always get marker on my hands? I don't know. I was like, where'd that even come from? But I did, I didn't use marker to clear off people's addresses, so like, no, no crazy people go hunt them down. 
be like, you sent Ali cool cards, I'm offended. Like, I don't know, but <laughs> yeah, just for safety, I do block out everyone's address. So I, I guess that's where that's from. But that is cool. What are they saying? Oh, like some of the newer Star Wars costume relics, it's like, were they screen worn at all? But this one is, it does say screen worn, not screen used or source fabric. It says authentic costume relic. Like, that is super awesome. Let's see what this. Oh, ooh, ooh, that's cool. That is a Kira sketch. Oh, wow. That is a very cool Kira sketch by Matthew Sutton. Ooh, nice. She looks really cool. I like her hair. Kira has really cool hair and her jacket. Like, I wish. Like, um, Ashley Eckstein's a fashion thingy. Her universe does make cool, like, Star Wars stuff. I hope one day they do make, like, a like a wearable Kira's jacket, because I would love to have that. That'd be so cool. That is awesome. And we have... <gasps> it's, uh, I remember seeing this on eBay at some point, or something like it. It's from the... Yeah. Oh, wow, it's from John Arton. Wow! John Arton's stuff is super amazing. From uh, Geonosis, the Battle of Geonosis. There's this guy, there's the cat thing that scratches Padme, and then there's the giant praying mantis. I can't remember what any of them are ever called. But I do have, actually down the road, I had found it long, not not super long time ago, maybe two years ago now, but they had bought a collection of old Star Wars figures, and by old, not like retro figures, but from when I was, I was younger, and they had the like whole Genosis arena, they had the three aliens, and there was also, what else did I get? I also got an Obi-Wan on Boga figure as well, so I have all those, and then a bunch of little loose battle droids at home, so that's cool. I need to get myself a display with all my stuff at some point, but this is awesome. Hey, and there's an Akbar here. Akbar, or another Mon Calamari, but this is cool. This one is by Jay Hammond. But this is awesome. I have three new sketches for my collection. A signed Ben Bishop book, more Ben Bishop signatures, authentic costume relics and bunker relics, so many different cool cards from everyone today. Oh my goodness, this is amazing. Look at these, they're sketch cards. That is so cool. But thank you so much, Kyle. This is amazing. I'm loving everything here, especially this. Oh my goodness, this is what was so heavy. All right, that makes that makes a lot more sense. I was worried. But this this is good. Why is there more marker here? Okay. <laughs> Allie struggles with markers for ten minutes or however long this video is, but this is amazing. Oh, that is so cool. I only have had one puck before, a sign puck, probably makes no sense to having but a friend was at a raffle and they had a, like a charity raffle and they had a there was a puck not remember i don't remember quite who it's signed by but it was actually signed by a blue jackets player and they won that little, little raffle thing and it's like okay so i had a, I had a signed puck from someone from blue jackets but now i have a ben bishop signed puck from the world cup of hockey that is so cool you know, with the jsa authentication that is so cool. I'll have to get one of those cool little display stands for this. That is so cool. Then again, these bunker, the bunker and costume relics, which I didn't have either one of these. These are from before I st when I started collecting, so that's cool. Love all these. Look at that Astate Ben Bishop. That is a really cool looking Ben Bishop as well. Ben Bishop pieces. Thanks to J Phrase and Kyle. I have matching Ben Bishop pieces. Now I'm just not some heretic that only has Dallas Lightning cards, or <laughs> Dallas Lightning, Dallas Ben Bishop relics. Then these, also from J Phrase, more Ben Bishop autograph, baby Ben Bishop rookie with the blues, and then all these cards from Sam Sports Shop, this one as well, the Cardi for Hagee, Carter, I said Cardi. <laughs> And these cool cards as well. Thank you so much, everyone. This was a truly amazing mail day. I'm super happy with everything I've gotten here. It's amazing that you guys send me things. I love all of it, and I will. I do promise to treasure everything. I have to figure out how I'm going to display this somewhere. But this is so cool. Wow. That's so cool. Ben Bishop 30. Ah, oh, man. But thank you so much, everyone. Really do appreciate it. This is absolutely amazing. And I hope you enjoyed watching me freak out over Ben Bishop cards and struggling to open packages and then get random mark over my head. And also at the BMV, I did get attacked by Baby Yoda as well. So lots of interesting stuff here today. Really do love it. Thank you so much to Sam, Kyle, 
and J Phrase for this amazing opening. And yeah, I hope everyone is staying safe and taking care. And I hope to catch up with all of you this Saturday night, 7.45 p.m. We do have those live streams. We might, I think we're going to let it go for another week and my boss and I will discuss. We might be splitting the streams up to just a, like maybe capping it at 2 a.m. might be good for like Saturday night. 7.45 to 2, and then the remainder of the breaks on Sunday night from 7.45 to about 2 again, because last week was 10 hours long, and I didn't have a good time, but it does really, it really does ruin my productivity on Sundays, which I mean, it's Sunday, so I'm not doing too much, but still, I'm not sure how long I will be able to sustain that without, like, uh, so, I mean, I do have coffee now, but that is still a very, very long time. But if you are interested in seeing any of those openings in that stream, it is up on the channel. It is that spooky 10-hour video, but everything, all those live streams always do have timestamps. You can find exactly what you're looking for. Don't be intimidated. It is a really fun time. But thank you so much, everyone, for this amazing mail day. This is great. Thank you so much. Really do appreciate it, and I hope all of you take care. So stay safe, and don't go too far, because I will see you probably on Friday. If not, I really do hope to see you all on Saturdays. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye!